everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Janae Lee and thank you so much for clicking on this video and tuning in today so on today's video I'm going to be walking you guys through my relaxer touch-up prep so it's basically what I do to prep my hair for my relaxer touch-up so if you're interested in watching that then keep on watching <laughs> all right so it is Monday it's a Monday August 16th and the last time I relaxed my hair was Monday May 17th so it has been 13 weeks since I relaxed my hair I've been trying to get on more of a 12 week schedule but this is just where we're at so it's 13 weeks I'm doing my pre relaxer prep and then I'll wait a week to actually relax my hair so next Monday will be 14 weeks and that's when my stretch will end. So, on to the products. So I'm going to use this African Pride Pre-Poo, it's a pre-shampoo. Next, I'll be doing a protein treatment. So I'll be mixing this with just some coconut oil. And then I'll be using the Cream of Nature Plex Breakage Defense Bond Mender Treatment. So it comes with their number one, the shampoo, which is the number two, and then the conditioner, which is the number three. Now this conditioner is actually really thick, and I'll be probably mixing this conditioner with, um, some oils. Yeah. I'm going to either sit under the hair dryer or sit under my um, heat cap. Let's just jump right into the pre shampoo. So for my natural hair days, I still do my hair in four sections. Like that's it's just what helps me not get overwhelmed by my hair. I mean, it's really you can see how long it is. Is what what is this? What is this? Like armpit like right above armpit length um it's not that long and it's not that thick but it's just still like just too much for me especially with all of this new growth in the two different textures that I have I just it's just easier for me to do it in four sections so this is like a like a jelly consistency but I really like it and it smells, it smells really good, which is always a plus for me. I love products that smells good. And I got these in a pack of three off of Amazon. So I'll link that below. I'll link all of the products that I'm using below. That way, if you want to try this out, then you can. for like 20 minutes and then I've been t-shirt drying my hair for about 10 minutes just to get the extra water off of my hair so that way I can go ahead and do this protein treatment so what I have now is just some coconut oil and this Affigy the two minute reconstructor this is the one that I use for my protein conditioner um, so I'm just gonna do like two spoonfuls of this and then mix it in with the conditioner and so you can probably see a little better now my new growth compared to my relaxed hair so it's been like I said 13 weeks so all of this is new growth so what like an inch an inch and a half Leave the 
conditioner in for like 20 30 minutes this is from the company thermal hair care they are hothead I actually really love this I got one for my daughter and uh, myself and it's so easy to just move about and still get a good heated condition and so that's what I'm gonna do this is their Instagram and I'll put it below too okay so I will be back after I condition and I t-shirt dry my hair and then we'll move on to the next step hey you guys so I'm back I washed out the protein conditioner and I air dried for about 10 minutes so now I am moving on to step one of the cream of nature plex breakage defense and it's a bond mender treatment so I use this the only time I use it is before a relaxer so yeah it's the only time I use it other than that I use the old plex at least once a month and during relaxer day as well but you'll see all that in my relaxer touch up so I'm gonna go ahead my hair's already split in fours I'm gonna go ahead and apply this I'm going to follow up with the ORS Olive Oil Creamy Aloe Shampoo. It's their um, clarifying shampoo. So I'm going to do one lather of this just to make sure my hair is nice and clean and stripped pretty much. Um, and then I'm going to follow up with their step two of the um, Plex Breakage Defense. So this is my scalp massager that I got off Amazon and came in a pack of two and I just massage my scalp while the shampoo is still in it okay guys so we are at the final step which is condition and I'm using step three of the Plex Breakage Defense, which is the restoring conditioner. So I just add some olive oil, some avocado oil, and some coconut oil. One to just penetrate my hair some more. Get it. for probably 30 minutes on I'm gonna rinse it out I'm gonna t-shirt dry for about 20 minutes try to get all of that extra oil out then I'm gonna go ahead and use the Afigy pro vitamin leave-in conditioner followed by it's a 10 leave-in product and then some jojoba oil. I literally only have a drop left, so I think it should be enough for my head. I'm gonna run some castor oil on my scalp, and then I'll probably just end up braiding my hair like two, four, two, four, six. I'll probably put eight um, braids in my hair and just leave it like that for the week. That way I'm not combing it. I'm not scratching at my scalp. I am not messing with my hair. I like to leave it alone for the week prior to relaxing it just so that when it comes to relaxing it and getting that relaxer most likely it's going to touch my scalp. I don't want my scalp to be irritated from me doing too much combing and too much scratching and too much. No, I don't want to mess up my scalp or have burns to my scalp because I've been messing with my hair all week. So I'm going to put it in braids, probably leave it in a nice little bun and keep it moving, especially because I work out six to seven times a week. My hair is going to be sweating. 
the um, new growth is going to get really coiled up and if it's in a regular ponytail or in a bun I'm gonna have to detangle it come the end of the week so I'm just gonna leave it in braids and it can dry faster that way throughout the week so with that being said I'm going to end the video right here before I head on out make sure you stick to the end to the very end of this video because in my end cards I'm going to add my relaxer hair playlist that way you can see all of my relaxed hair content and I'm going to go ahead and add my relax her touch up routine once that video is up and running so that way you can watch part two to this video which is the actual relaxer touch up thank you so much for watching like this video give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and comment down below what your pre-relaxer routine is throw out some steps throw out some products you like to do and maybe i'll add it to my routine give it a try i'm always looking for something new that will better benefit my hair in the long run so make sure you subscribe if you haven't already thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time Bye. -bye.